next to the political building, the castle, where he was ruling Florence from, he wanted to have another big building to put inside all the office of the various cities of the city of the region over which he was ruling. From there, the name of this building, Uffizi, from offices, gallery, because nowadays it's a famous gallery, renowned all over the world. You know, going in, we would yeah. take a whole afternoon just to see this gallery here, uh -huh. there they but I'd like to point out all these statues, I mean some of these statues that you see here in the Uffizi, these are all about people from Florence and Tuscany. <clears throat> and I mentioned to you, Michelangelo, is that one there partially in the scaffolding? This Dante Alighieri you must not forget. Have you heard about Dante Alighieri? The writer of the Divine Comedy, a book divided into three parts, Inferno, Purgatory, and Paradise. He's written in many journeys that he does into this world. What was important about it is that um, it was written with the language of the Florentine people at the oh. beginning of the 1300s. That language has become pretty much the Italian language we all speak. So Dante Alighieri is considered the father of the Italian language. Oh. Remember this name Dante Alighieri? If you don't know who Dante is, it's like if you have never heard about Shakespeare. Oh, yeah. And from here you can see the famous big food that you see that big from a distance of ship. Yeah. That bridge is very ancient. Anybody, anybody. But that one. How come? That's because a fascist Florentine asked the Germans to stare at them and leave that bridge. So that nobody will be able to fix it in you. For that reason, this bridge remained in front of the We will take one more break on the top for you to see the Michelangelo Square or Michelangelo Square. From the top, the viewing point, also uh, toilets, you can use the restrooms also. From there, we leave for Pisa, and uh, I'm hoping to be in Pisa by 6 o'clock. Uh, we should be in Pisa, which is good time. We have an hour in Pisa to do your shopping. Five minutes to look at the tower, and 55 minutes for shopping, always. Whoa. Or if you don't want to shop, shop, one hour for you to look at the tower itself. <laughs> Well, I know for pizza, nobody cares about the pizza. They take photographs and they're back in their business. Shopping, 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 shopping. It never ends. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah,